Good morning, everybody. We just got finished with breakfast. I got the kitchen cleaned up. The coffee maker's going over there because I'm about to make another cup of coffee. And I'm making a to-do list of some things I wanna get done in the kitchen this morning. Uh, the kids are all getting started on their schoolwork. I have a grocery pickup order scheduled for this afternoon, so I wanna get a few things done before I go pick that up. The number one thing is clean out the refrigerator. Actually, both of them. The one in here and the one in the laundry room, but the one in the laundry room, they're actually both not too bad because I did a really good clean out of them, you know, not long ago. But I just need to clean them out and straighten them up so that when I get finished with the groceries, I can easily put everything away. I hate when I wait until I get the groceries and then I have to clean it out while I'm putting the groceries away. I hate that. So we're going to get that done before we go pick them up. I also want to clean the microwave this morning. I want to clean the sink over there and my little tray that holds my dish detergent and all that. I want to clean that up. So we'll just put sink area. Oh, and I want to wipe off the stove top. So yeah, not too much. I should be able to get all of this done before I go pick up the groceries. I was going to do an afternoon in the kitchen this afternoon, but since I have the grocery pickup order scheduled for this afternoon, it's going to be hard to do that in the afternoon. So we're going to do this this morning. Oh, by the way, the scones that we had for breakfast this morning, I made those last night and y'all saw them in yesterday's video. Y'all have actually already seen the grocery haul too because I'm posting that before this. So that was in yesterday's video. If you missed it, I'll link it down below. Did that acorn just fall down? Can you carry this one? Okay. Thank you. It is now time to cook supper. I'm cooking just a little bit early this afternoon. Manly's still taking his nap. He usually wakes up around 3.30. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to get supper in the oven. This is gonna take about an hour to cook once we get it in the oven. It's a cheesy sour cream chicken. I saw this recipe on Pinterest and it looks really good. So the first thing I'm gonna do is trim up all my chicken and get it into my casserole dish. Ooh, that chicken is cold. I'm gonna go ahead and spray the casserole dish. That way I can just put the chicken right over in here. I love this casserole dish. It's a little bit bigger than a 9 by 13 and it's pretty deep. I got it from Walmart a couple of years ago. All it says on the back of it is, let's celebrate or something. Way to celebrate. They used to put some different ones of these out every year. I haven't seen any this year. Of course, I haven't been inside Walmart much, but y'all let us know if y'all have seen any in the stores this year. But yeah, they used to put different ones out around, you know, the different holidays. This chicken, I'm telling y'all, it's freezing my hands. It's freezing. <laughs> Wasn't in the freezer, but it's freezing. Mm -hmm. So with the chicken, we're gonna have rolls, baked potatoes, and salads. I have some of those uh, sweet Hawaiian rolls that I got from Aldi the other day. And I don't know if I'm gonna be able to fit all of my chicken in here. I might have to use another smaller casserole dish too. Mm -hmm. Cece's drawing pictures while I'm cooking. She drew a picture of Manly's horse. The one that says baked with love. I have the oven preheated to 375. We've got the chicken ready now. Okay, now in this bowl, we're gonna put some sour cream. I have to come in here to get it. The one in here is almost empty. 
Cece wants y'all to see the horse. Isn't that good? You did a good job. And the butterfly ones. Oh, and little bees. Those are very nice, Sissy. This one that had a little bit of sour cream in it, we're gonna go ahead and empty it out. And then I can have Now, we don't need the whole um, thing. We need about half of it in there, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm using a little bit more than the recipe calls for because I have more chicken, so. In here with it, we're gonna put some salt and pepper. This is reminding me of something I've made before and I feel like it's the, the slow cooker John Wayne casserole that we make. I'm okay. reaching for the salt and pepper behind y'all here. <laughs> so we're just putting in salt and pepper. Now we're gonna put in the garlic powder. Now we need cheese. I think bacon would be a really good thing to add to this. The recipe didn't say to, so, and I don't wanna cook it right this minute, but I think bacon, but that would kinda of make it like the Monterey, well not really, cause the Monterey chicken doesn't have the sour cream. Anyway, we're gonna skip the bacon this time, but I think bacon would be really good. So this is a very cheesy sour cream chicken. We're putting in some shredded sharp cheddar in there with the sour cream. And then we're also gonna put some cheese slices over here on top of the chicken. So that's it. Now we just take some of the sour cream mixture and spread it all over the top of the chicken. Like I said, I'm really feeling that bacon would be delicious if we had a strip of bacon on top of each piece of chicken too. I'm almost wishing I would've made some bacon now, but it's okay. ready so we're gonna cover it for the first 30 minutes and then we'll uncover it that's it Okay, y'all, we've already tasted a little bit of the chicken, and it's pretty good. I would say if you decide to make this, add the bacon, or I went by the recipe, so, you know, and it didn't say to add bacon or anything else, but I feel like it needs a little something, something, it needs a little more flavor going on. It is good, though, just, you know, a little more flavor wouldn't hurt. Maybe some bacon, maybe some green onions sprinkled over the top. Got your boots. We had to come get Manly's boots out of the van. Got them? Okay. Okay. Here we go. Oh, we need to bring the blower over here and get these leaves off. Shooey. There's a lot of leaves back here. We gotta get the blower. Yesterday, it was too wet back here. So, I mean, we could have raked them, but they were all stuck to the ground. So we didn't get the blower out, but now they're all dried out, ready to blow out of the way. And they wanna make a leaf pile to jump in. So we got the kitchen cleaned up. I've been trying to have supper done a little bit earlier since it gets dark so early now. That way the kids have time to come outside for a little bit after supper. I like coming out a little bit after supper too, walk around, you know, walk that supper off a little bit. Okay, I come. You coming? Okay. He's wanting to play instead this evening. Jonah's right here playing, so he's wanting to play with him. Oh, he's coming now. Tyler's bringing the leaf blower to make him a leaf pile. Manly doesn't like the leaf blower like because it's so loud, you know. What's he got? <laughs> That's too close to the pond. Put it over there on that side. Let's see what y'all got going on in here, girls. The bag is empty, but I think the feeders are full. A couple of y'all asked about this feed the other day. It's Nature Wise Layer Feed. We got it from Tractor Supply. It's got this hen right here on the front of it. Both of the feeders are almost full, though, so they have enough until tomorrow. Pick a boo, Roosty. Are you climbing that tree? Look how high he is in this tree. Oh my goodness. How'd you get up there, boy? <laughs> He's acting like a monkey. He's a monkey. That's at least a good nine, six inches six on one inches. side, nine on the other. Yeah, woo! I jump off on the short side. <laughs> oh, it broke. It's a bowl. Yeah. It's time to rearrange the punk punks. Here we go. The other day, I don't know if you saw, but there was a spider, like, as big almost as his oh, face on him. Oh. It was a big spider. But the There's another dig in the tail motion. <laughs> it was big. 
big. It really was. Legs and all about that big. Body and all. I mean, whenever he got on him, I thought that thing was from Halloween. It was a spider head. And I was like, no, you ain't in my yard, spider head. <laughs> this is Sissy's favorite one. She said it looks like a little cupcake. It does. What's a cupcake? Oh. <laughs> oh, daddy go? He's over there. The race. There goes Manly trailing behind. Uh -huh. Oh, he's done. He's like, nope, I'm done. Here comes your newest horse. Oh boy! <laughs> <laughs> the Nazi on the 